I say I look so good tonight. Okay, so I can't sing like Beyonce, but um, I can wear her clothes though. I can wear her clothing line though. She's cute. She's cute. She's cute. She's cute. Okay, so you guys have actually seen this one already because it was in the intro. Love the Ivy Park logo on there. I wasn't even sure I was gonna like the color. I was just like, you know, let me just pick the green one because my Instagram theme is green and I don't really like pink and the light stuff wasn't really, wasn't really going with me. I got a size medium and they say that the size medium in the UK is a 12 to 14, but it just says 14. I was a bit confused by the sizing. I don't really know why I'm telling you guys all this. It's not like they're still available to buy. It's sold out in 20 minutes, but but maybe for the next drop you guys might want to buy something so i'm just telling you guys how it fits now i like the yellow here and the little neon yellow on the on the sleeves it's so so cute you guys i am not the biggest like hype beast celebrity outfit kind of person like i'm not that person at all um i just thought let me just try the eye let me see if i like it and i put on the outfit this morning and I was really feeling myself like I was really I mean I don't want to say I was feeling like Beyonce in Beyonce's clothes but I was really kind of like you know just like a little a little extra I wanted to do a little dance I had um I woke up like this played in my head all day <laughs> I had to go to two different stores. So I bought some stuff on ASOS and I bought some stuff on uh, uh, Adidas as well. I think the online store opened at 12 a.m. Um, I was waiting for it to refresh the night before on the 29th and nothing was happening. And then I woke up on the 30th and then half the stuff was sold out. And I'm really glad that I actually got the small because I think the medium would be too big when it stretches out also i'm losing weight i'm looking like a little bit of weight so um it would be too big for me within a month so i'm glad i got this small now let me tell you guys the thing that i love love about it's like people with ocd and people who like symmetry are gonna love this these lines they fit exactly when i say exactly like it's a perfect 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 fit you guys the lines here match up with the lines on this and on the butt as well so you don't get no panty lights it's perfect it's perfect <gasps> she woke up like this i love the fact that you can see my tattoo through the mesh yes so <laughs> it still looks good though those were the first two things but um <laughs> you girl got a box here. Oh, and um, <laughs> you girl got a box here. <laughs> when I said I did the most, I really, I really did the most. The one thing that I really have to say about this clothing line as well that it kind of hit me, not just how cute it was, but how well made and how practical it actually is. Like I can actually go running like this. I don't know if this is a running outfit, but I can go running out with it. Like the cycling shorts really, it really is. If you were to wear a sports bra, it really is the one. And the hat, I can go running in that. Like it's, yeah. Another thing about the hat though, it's reversible, but um, you have to cut off the tag right here. Um, but I got makeup on the hat. But you're getting two for the price of one, which was really nice of her because she didn't, she didn't have to do that. You guys know how these celebrities like to make money off of their name like they will put one thing these brands they'll put one thing and sell it for like 500 pounds so she really did not have to make it reversible and practical her and Rihanna are the only ones that I'm seeing that are doing like I want to say budget friendly because I mean you can get workout gear a lot cheaper than Ivy Park but within a good price range for the quality that you're getting so I got the hat and and Another accessory that I got, I did. I did get the socks, you guys. They come in every color and they were 21 pounds. Don't judge me, okay? I thought I wanted the whole outfit, but um, the socks, it's a bit much. I have to say, I did test out the shoes to see if they would be comfortable 
um, I went walking, I did exercise, I did insanity, I went running, I got them in a size 7 and they are very, very comfy. Normally I cannot leave my trainers on when I'm doing high intensity workouts, like I'm doing aerobics or anything like jumping, um, anything that requires stretching. I can leave them on for running but not for HIIT because my feet hurt so bad in them. I know I've got to get insoles um, but I think I have like kind of kind of flat or not as curved arches as everyone else so yeah normally I can't but I kept them on that whole time and they didn't hurt so maybe that might wear out because the shoes get less absorbent less bouncy um, but right now it's pretty good this is the sports bra I got it in the neon yellow I figured that it would match the cycling shorts and it matches the trainer so whichever one I decide to keep I'll like it anyway, so it shouldn't really matter, but I am not loving the sports bra. It's padded and for girls who already have big boobs, like I don't need extra padding like if I'm working out. It also doesn't feel that secure if I'm really honest. However, it does have some straps in the back and they are thick thick. I don't like how it bunches on the sides. I've done up the bra straps finally, they're really fiddly. Um, yeah, my boobs are not secure in that. I'm not a person that does style over practicality, not when it comes to workout gear. I, I guess people aren't really using this for like working out and sports stuff. They're obviously using it to like, you know, look cute while they go run their little errands, go to the shops. Eh. But I would actually want a bra that costs 60 pounds to be a bra. I did the measurements and everything, so it's no, it's not that it's too small for me. It literally is my size. It's just, it's ill-fitting. It's what it is. And that's a damn shame because I was really rooting to be super cute in my Afro puffs. I got this stretchy band hat. So yeah, this is the hat you guys, and just imagine like my afro puff would be high up on my head, like right here, if it wasn't under the wig, and it's looking super cute. <laughs> and I'm not even a bucket hat kind of person, but this, this actually looks like summer. It looks like a summer outfit. Definitely, she should have dropped this for summer and not in the middle of winter, but I mean, I guess I can go to St. Lucia looking kind of, kind of fly. Let me show you guys the outfit for this one, for, for this hat and everything. I got the brown shorts in a size medium. So we'll see if it fits. I'm not I'm not 100% sure. It's quite stretchy. Can we look at how small the medium is? Look, look, it looks like a child's trousers. Look at it. I really thought it wasn't gonna fit, but it definitely fits. It's actually got room. It's very, very roomy. Um, I don't think you can wear this with underwear. I am wearing it with underwear right now, obviously, because I'm not sure if I'm keeping it or not. Um, but you can see every line, every little, every, every, it's not like the green one where you can't see like lines, but you can see every line. And this is what the back looks like. It's nice, it's cute, the butt looks okay. I don't like how tight it sits on my thighs. I don't feel I don't feel as cute in it as I did with the green. The socks, I have to say, I really love the retro vibe of the socks. Like the socks are really cute. Oh, and these ones, the Ivy Park logo is at the back. See the logo for the Ivy Park is at the back. And I got the hoodie. The hoodie I got in a medium material feels really good. I must say that feels it's very thick. It feels really really good. Yeah, it feels really good. I was just giving it to Reagan. She's here, she's in the corner to, to feel it. She's like, mm-hmm, you like it? Like, she's she's busy nodding her head. She's like, mm-hmm, this is it, sis. Okay. Okay, you guys, so this is the second look. I love how this feels. This feels so cute. I love the socks with the, just the, just the outfit. It's just, it's just magic, okay? But. I'm gonna do some restyling. I mean, I know Beyonce is a style queen, and she style everything, whatever. But 
flipping this over doubling it is a better fit for me I feel like it's tighter on my waist and I feel like it gives me a better looking booty so I flipped the hat just no <laughs> I flipped the hat it's cute I do like it and with the hoodie this is what it looks like see I look so good tonight got it got it got it Da 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 da. You know why? With the. I do have two of these. I have an extra hoodie and another one of these. Um, I think I'm gonna do a giveaway. I don't know if I'm gonna send it back. I think I might just do a giveaway. So, if you wanna enter the giveaway, all you gotta do is subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. Is right here at Raven Navarro and leave a comment on the Ivy Park reel that I just did tell me why you'd like to win that's it that's it that's it that's it three things subscribe to my YouTube channel follow me on Instagram and leave a comment oh the giveaway is open to uh, the UK UK only okay okay so this hoodie is in a medium I, I got two it's in a medium just like this one so if you're my size, then this is the hoodie for you. Um, and this one is in a small, in a size 10. Okay, next, next, yes. You thought I was done? I'm not done. Next up, I got some shoes. I got these. They're very similar to, oh, can you, there we go. They are very similar to um, the green ones. I don't know if I really like these ones that much. However, I do know I would wear them a lot more simply because these are like bright as, and these ones are more chilled, so I'd wear these to go out somewhere. I don't like how how bent up they are though, so that's that's rubbing me the wrong way. But yeah, it's good, good, good things. I, I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But anyway, I'm gonna put on the next outfit, and this is my last last thing. Oh. I bought the pouch. I bought the pouch. I wouldn't wear both bags at the same time, although you could. And I got it in a small to medium. I'm gonna put on the next outfit, and this is my last, last thing. I saw Beyonce wearing a kind of suit looking thing, and I really wanted it, and I realized it's the tracksuit. So I got the tracksuit. They made it look so, so, so shit on the website. It just looked like, I was like, where is it? Where is it? I've been searching for it for ages, not realizing. I actually got it to sell out before I realized it's the tracksuit and they just opened up the sides. So I had to go buy it on ASOS. She made it look like it was some fancy going out dinner jacket. You know, I was like, wait, what? I have to try this. I have to at least see it. I mean, I did the little Beyonce off-shoulder top tracksuit bottom kind of thing, but you know, this kind of looks like a vibe. I'd wear it with heels, not with these. Um, I'm just keeping the iPod theme going. Um, I would style it with some some leggings, most likely, and heels instead of trainers for a nice kind of sexy casual look. I didn't know a tracksuit top from Adidas, like the, like an actual tracksuit tracksuit top, could be sexy, but it's sexy. Um, I'm not sure about the bag. I don't really like the bomb bag too much. This belt is 30 pounds, and this one was with the bag 60 something. Together they make up 100 pounds. Is that coincidence? I think not. Let's get rid of all of this. So we keep this. Okay. I know Beyonce didn't think of this one though. It's definitely just to look cute. Definitely. If I bought the yellow bag with this, it would be a look. Okay. Did I just make my own Beyonce outfit? Did I did I just make my own style? Yes, yes, I think I did. Let me see, I don't even want these, this one. Let's put this belt with it. 
it almost kind of wants to look like a martial arts kind of thing. <laughs> okay, I guess you guys have had enough of my shit. Um, yeah, I just I just remixed my own Beyonce outfit, so I'm feeling pretty proud of myself. I don't know what exactly I'm keeping, but I do like I do like most of the looks that I got. I think that's everything. Let me check the bag again. Yeah, that's everything. So you guys. Thank you for watching again. If you want to enter the giveaway, all you gotta do is subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on Instagram, and leave a comment on the reel, on the reel of this Ivy Park situation that we got going on here. Tell me why you why you want it. And that's it. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. So yeah, I'm giving away one hoodie and one uh what do you call it? One hoodie and one cat suit, bottom suit, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, that thing, that, that right there. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one. I hope you enjoyed, and do let me know what you thought of the little cute outfits. Bye.